All right, so in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the inspect element in your uh, browser. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the Edge browser to check the responsiveness of your e-learning course, or at least kind of emulate how it's going to work on the device. Now, these things don't always work perfectly, but it does help if you have published output and you want to kind of see what it looks like. Uh, here's an e-learning course. I'm going to right click and I'm going to go to inspect element. And what you're going to see here is the inspect element panel. We don't care about all this gibberish. You can learn more about that if you want to. Uh, we're going to click the drop down here and you're going to see there's one that says emulation. So we're going to go ahead and click on that. And you can cho choose a device and some other things. Uh, the main thing is uh, you can pre-select a device. Unfortunately, apparently in the Microsoft world, um, everything's only Microsoft, <laughs> but that's okay for now. So we're going to go ahead and click on this. Uh, device here and then you can see how the the screen itself responds to the device so you can kind of get a sense of how um, the device uh, or the course itself responds to that now if you're not using one of these devices you can always come down here and customize it I think the main thing is that you can choose an aspect ratio or dimension uh, here you can see um, that you can add a custom resolution and you can also test that between the landscape and portrait modes and see uh, see how that uh, responds. Not quite as dynamic as the Firefox and Chrome options, uh, which are in the other tutorials, but it does let you show or it does show you how that works. And you could just add custom resolutions here. You can come in here and select from some presets or just add your own. Hopefully that helps.